Oh my god, Lupo, why are you on MW3 like all the other kids here on YouTube? Uh, now, what is up, everyone? You have reached my second channel. I thank you so, so much from the bottom of my uh, toilet seat that you came out to my second channel. Um, but uh, my name is Lupo, and I hope you enjoy today's little story and commentary about what to expect with YouTube if you're starting out on it. It is 2011. If you're still starting out on YouTube, I'm going to be going over the basins. And of course, I am playing MW3 like I did intro here. I did end up going about 29 or 25 and 9. I did pretty decent. I was using the UMP45 and uh, on my one of favorite levels on here. I forget the name, but uh, it is a fun level, I forget what it's called, but that is not the story today, but I do hope you enjoy the gameplay, I try hard at a little bit for you guys, so liking down below or uh, sharing some good feedback about it would be appreciated, but what am I going to be going over today? I get this question over and over and over, you know, this is my second channel, it's a little bit of a smaller channel, but I do cater towards you guys that are really into me and want to follow me and have good advice I this is more for you guys and it's something special to come out to and it really does mean a lot when you do come out and it is a really cool thing for me to be able to do this on a smaller scale and have everyone's questions answered and this is one of the most important things that I get asked on one of my bigger channels my main channel actually the it's Lupo channel now if I'm not boring you to death I hope I don't do that because if I do I have failed and I hope I don't do that but your question is I get this all the time I'm going to read this directly from my PM inbox hey Lupo I recently got into YouTube and I have posted videos, I'm trying really hard, but I'm not getting the amount of views that I would really want and no one's really subscribing to me. Okay, congratulations, you started YouTube. First step into uh, getting your name out there, but what to expect from YouTube and out of this question, now let me analyze it. Starting YouTube is nothing that you can just hop right into and expect views right away unless you have content that is extremely unique and that you know will go viral or it's something insane like that guy dropping dead in the corner of this house. See what I did there? But um, unless it's something insane and it just takes off immediately, you won't be getting tons of views, alright? I've seen this happen tons and tons of times where people get into YouTube, they start it up, and then you get no views, and then they quit, they start a new channel, they hope to get views on this one, no views at all, and they quit, start a new channel. It's an endless cycle of no profit or gain. And what I mean about this is people start new channels when they get no views thinking all the subs are inactive. Well. It depends on what you do. Yeah, I have an active subs, but that doesn't affect me. I like doing what I'm doing because I like it. And that's one of the things people need to understand here on YouTube is when you produce content, you have to do it because you like it. If you do it just solely off views, I'll tell you right now, you're not going to get anywhere on YouTube with that, all right? Because the way it works, every minute, there's 50 hours of video uploaded. You gotta realize, the competition is so big, it's so vast. Getting one view on its own is an incredible miracle. And getting 20 and complaining about no views happening at all, that's just being ignorant. <laughs> You're being ignorant, dog. But um, seriously though, there's 50 hours uploaded each minute. And when you get no views, you gotta understand, YouTube's flooded with footage. You just gotta find a way to make yourself unique and in a way where you want people to keep coming back. And you gotta treat your footage with some kind of dignity and you've gotta respect it. And like I said, you've gotta like what you do. You know, YouTube's not a thing where you start it up and eight months later, you're getting thousands of views, you're getting hundreds of subs. I mean, yeah, I've seen people do that. And those are very, very, very special cases. And I know you've people seen people do that. Um, and that's a very, very special case. That just doesn't happen, alright? <laughs> um, got my little UMP45 marksman and I died right there, but a little off topic. Um, those successes on YouTube just don't always happen like that. You know, there's a reason why you remember them for that. It's because they are unique and they, they made it happen. You know, they put tons of work in and YouTube, honestly, to build yourself up a nice channel 
potentially give yourself a chance of partnership it takes about a year or two of work on your YouTube. You got to be producing content which you like producing, all right? And most of the times, people just put videos out to put videos out and hop on a bandwagon, and then they complain about no views happening anyway. Well, there's a reason. I always put myself in the position of, would I watch this video? I want you to put your guys self in that position when you make a video. Would you watch your own video? That is my self-taught um, motivation for a video. If I'm not going to watch it myself, why would anyone else want to watch it? You know what I mean? You gotta be able to look at it from an audience's standpoint and think, boy, is this video going to be good or is it gonna just be another video on YouTube you gotta remember make yourself so nice and you ma just make it unique make it yourself and one of the last things I want to talk about is channel names when you start up a channel on YouTube don't ever limit yourself with a channel name I see this happen way too much like um my friend was gonna name his channel Eclipse Sniping or something don't ever put sniping gaming or any of that just make it one simple unique name alright I've made Lupo for myself you know it doesn't really pertain to anything it's just a broad general thing because if you want to change your style and you limit yourself to sniping and when you do change to like montages or tutorials you're going to be killing your audience and they're going to unfollow you they came for sniping and when you change it and you limit yourself with a bad name look what you've done yourself you've essentially killed your own channel due to what you want to do and you limited yourself with the name and of course, if you want better video views, a liking down below would appreciate me, <laughs> would be appreciated, because I will do a video on how to properly tag your videos on how to boost your views that way. So uh, that is my little commentary for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the hell out of this. I know I did producing this for you guys. And um, never give up on your YouTube thing. All right, if you honestly do enjoy it and it's something that you cherish and you like doing, you won't give up. It takes a lot of work. It's a long road. And I wish you the best of luck. And liking down below, if I get like 30 or 40 likes on this on my smaller channel right here, I'll do a video on how to properly tag your videos to get yourself better views in the long run. So thanks, guys, for coming out. Have a great day. I had a great Christmas. And see you till then. You